Excel quiz, with answers, and, demo. What is the quickest way, to find the sum of numbers, in cells B3 to B7? A. Use the sum formula. B. Use the sum if, formula. C. Use the sum if s, formula. D. Highlight cells, B3 to B7. The correct answer is, D. Say, you want to quickly find the sum, or total, of a bunch of numbers, without wanting to store the sum. Here's how to go about it. Just highlight the column with numbers. The sum displays in the status bar, along with the average, and count, of the numbers. What are the ways, to change the number for north? from 132, to 132.6, without having to retype the entire number. A. Click cell B4, and click in the formula bar, and change. B. Double click cell B4, and change the number. C. Click the number in B4, and type the number. D. Both A and B, are correct. The correct answer is, D. Here's a tip, to save some data entry time. Use one of the two ways, to change the value for North Zone, from 132 to 132.6, without having to retype, I repeat, without having to retype, the entire data. Let's look at method 1. First, click cell, B4. Next, click the formula bar. Type the decimal, and digit 6. Click Enter. Here is method 2. First, double click, cell B4. Next, type the decimal, and digit 6. Click Enter. How would you, center the text, in millions, between cells A2 and D2? A. Highlight cell A2, and click, center text icon. B. Highlight cells, A2, to D2, and click merge and center. C. Click and drag cell A2, till the text is in the center of A2, and D2. D. Not possible to center the text, between A2 and D2. The correct answer is, B. Okay, here is how you can center the text, in millions, between cells A2, and D2. First, click cell, A2. Then, drag the cursor till cell, D2. Release the mouse. As the last step, click Merge and Center, in the alignment group. What is the quickest way, to delete, an entire worksheet? A. Highlight all the cells, press delete. B. Click the first cell with data, and shift click last cell with data, press delete. C. Highlight and delete, the visible part of worksheet, highlight rest, delete. D. Click delete, click delete sheet, the correct answer is, D. The question is, what is the quickest way, to delete an entire worksheet? Before you want to delete an entire worksheet, think twice. Why? Because the data is permanently deleted. If you deleted an entire worksheet, and then realize it was a mistake, here's what you should do. Close the worksheet without saving it. Okay, let's find out how to delete an entire worksheet. For this demo, we will delete this worksheet. Click Delete, in the Cells group. 
Click Delete Sheet. Click the Delete button in the dialog. The data is gone. You know how to get it back, right? Close the worksheet, without saving it. What is the first step, to format cells, that indicate more than $1 million in sales? A. Manual identification of each cell. B. Sort the data. C. Click conditional formatting. D. Click format as table. The correct answer is, C. Many times, you would want to quickly identify data in cells, that meet a condition. For instance, sales of more than 1 million, in all the quarters of a financial year. Here's how to identify data in cells, that fulfill a condition. First, highlight the range of cells in the worksheet, you want to apply the condition. Click the first cell, and shift click the last cell. Second, click Conditional Formatting, in the Styles group. For this demo, we will identify cells, that indicate sales greater than 1 million. Click Highlight Cell Rules, then, Greater Than. Last, type 1 in the dialog, and then click OK. Deselect. The cells that meet the condition, are highlighted in a different color.